Hey, so this is Kira, and I am in New York City. I am in Manhattan. Um, model friend Rebecca Lawrence is home. It's where I am right now. And today I took the train into town, into the city, and made it okay. And actually, it was kind of creepy seeing people in their masks. I wasn't expecting to see as many, and I actually wasn't expecting there to be as much space on the trains like everyone was really spaced about and normally it's really crowded now it was a saturday morning and most people are not out and about on saturday but i was still definitely a lot less people than i expected um then i went to this wonderful photo shoot and it was the reason that got me in the city i was kind of trepidatious if i should be dealing with that and um Got to do a photo shoot with serpents, with snakes, which was really happy. So the kind of creepy feeling that I had when I was in the city in the subway system was washed away by serpents. And it was wonderful. The snakes kind of go all over the place making these photos. Um, and then it got washed away because I was modeling with my friend Rebecca. And suddenly I jumped up because there was something wet and the snake had took a poop. So all this talk about coronavirus and needing toilet paper, this snake needed a lot of toilet paper. Who knew that snakes were like that? So anyway, super gross, took a shower. Fortunately, there was a shower in the studio. There isn't always one. So thankfully, all okay. Um, yeah, so creepy snake who it's just what you really wanted to hear. So anyway, there are a lot grosser things than snake poop, and that would be the silent and deadly coronavirus that we have all been hearing about. It is a national emergency, and I just got wind of the fact that they are going to shut down the city. Nobody's really, really said that, but they're shutting down a lot of places, and it sounds like it's coming. And, you know, if I'm going to get stuck, I just don't want to be stuck in New York City. You know, I'm in, you know, I'm in a home right now and it's really nice having a home to be in, but it is not mine and I don't have any food. I don't have what I need. I don't have much clothes. I do have a camera. Um, I do have a tripod. There's a ring light. You can tell that there's a ring light because the light's pretty okay and I'm shattering it myself. So anyway, I am going to be in town doing another couple of shoots tomorrow. They are local to Manhattan, not very far from here. And then on Monday, I don't even know what day it is, I am going to go to Staten Island in a car. Hopefully everything's still going. And then after that, I'm getting out of Dodge. I'm going home. I am mega, mega, mega disappointed about having to say goodbye to the rest of my shoots. I have like, I don't know, like, another 14 hours of photo shoots, but one of them is a guy that can't even get here because he's in Florida. He is wonderful, but if he can't get here, I can't shoot together. And then the rest are local people. And fortunately, I think most people are understanding I sent out the emails. Um, I am, I, you know, when I set up a commitment, I do it and I'm kind of worried. So anyway, I know this isn't super exciting talk. Um, certainly is not sexy right now. There's nothing sexy about a virus that is deadly and wrecking havoc on things. So yeah, anyway, I am safe and in New York City and I need to take a shower because today was long and lots of rolling around on the ground and snakes and blit. So, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to take a shower. You say, stay safe. And this is me pulling the plug on the rest of my New York City trip soon. And, wow, I have, huh. So that's leftover lipstick. I wiped off most of it. My eyes still have makeup, so that's good. But this is, this is pretty pretty terrible. So I'm going to take a shower so that I stop droning on about the really disappointing fact that I have to go home and I don't want to go home. I want to make art and work and whatnot. So anyway, hopefully all goes okay. I get out of here. I can see my grandmother before I leave. And yeah, so anyway, you take care of yourselves and get yourself to somewhere safe where you'd like to be for the next couple of three weeks in case you were going to get stuck. I am going to do that very soon. Fingers crossed it all goes okay and I can get 
back to my car and back to my home in time. Um, I think I should because the schools are still open in New York City, so there can't actually be a quarantine yet. So anyway, great day making art, and I at least have a plan set in motion because um, sometimes you have to roll with the punches. So yeah, stay safe, and I will talk to you later. Yeah, this is Kira. Check out my links below if you want to know who this person is droning on about, like snakes and coronavirus and whatnot. I guess if I am at home a little bit more, I will have extra days to make weird stuff to share with you. So anyway, stay safe. I think I've already said that. I'm going to talk to you. Okay.